All right, well this is me testing out my new magnetic stirrer that I just made. It's in a, just in a little plastic hobby box case. A little dirty from all the stickers on it. But all I did was just man, mount a fan on the inside. And I glued some Nemodiite magnets on top of that fan so when it turns on, it'll spin the magnetic stirrer. So let's get started. Today I'll be using my Red Sea test kit and my alkalinity. And I'm going to go ahead and drop one of these little magnetic stirrers about the size of, probably about half the size of a Tylenol. I'm going to drop one inside of each of my bottles and that way it always stays in there. And we're going to center it up on top of the magnetic stir. Alright, so our first test is actually going to be alkalinity. I have my 10 ml already drawn up of my tank water and I have 1 ml of the alkalinity solution. So I'm going to go ahead and inject the 10 ml into the bottle. And then we're going to plug in our Magnetic stir. There we go. And we're kind of wanting that orangish color to turn. So first it's going to be blue. And notice I'm not having to worry about shaking every time I'm putting a drop in. I'm just worrying about putting a drop. And it mixes for me automatically. Now I'm going to try to zoom in here. Actually, the wrong way. There we go. Should be getting a little bit close now. One more. There we go. Now it's staying. Alright. And then you just read your syringe accordingly. Now this... I ended up putting 0.5 mLs. So our DKH is actually very low. It's actually 7.0 on this. So now all I got to do is just unplug. And 